A big step forward for the Magic City today as plans to build a new stadium move forward. Yeah, WVTM 13's Chip Scarborough is live tonight in Uptown, right where that new stadium will sit. Chip? Yeah, I'm literally standing in what will be the end zone of Protective Stadium. An unveiling ceremony wrapped up just a short time ago, but the celebration is still very much ongoing, as you can see right there. Let's get you right to the images. This is what everybody's been waiting on, and this is what the new Protective Stadium will look like. The life insurance company, which employs about 1,500 people in the Birmingham area, will hold the name rights to the facility for at least the next 15 years. Of course, the $174 million open-air stadium will be home to UAB football and other large city and county events. You need to take a picture now because you won't recognize it in five years. It's going to change it tremendously. It's going to affect the quality of life and improve the quality of life of our of our citizens. And crews here are already kind of starting to move the utility lines around as the project gets underway. You should really notice things to start cranking up here sometime in July. The stadium will be done in 2021, but it's not clear if it'll be done, be done in time for the World Games. Live in Uptown, Chip Scarborough, WVTM 13. And leaders are hoping to have the stadium ready in time for the World Games, which begin in 826 days. Happening now, an exit.